everyone. Welcome to CC's Fashion Is My Passion YouTube channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. If you're a returning viewer or a subscriber, welcome on back. Well, you guys, today's video, if you saw by the title, it is a Shein plus size curvy girl swimsuit haul. Yes, ma'am, and yes, sir. Everything in this video is a size 4X, which is a size 20 in numerical numeral number. Did I say it right? Because you know I always get tongue tied. So if you have never shopped from Shein and you are wondering, what is Shein? And can I wear Shein clothing because I'm a plus size woman? Well, you can because I'm a plus size woman. Everything on Shein that I purchase or select is plus size, which is a size 20 or 22. A 20 is a size 4X. A 22 is a size 5X. However, if you are not plus size and you are just a regular size woman and you're not real, real bodaciously curvy like me, they have something there for you too. And fellas, they have something for you. They have something for the, the, the dog, the cat, probably the fish too, honey, or the ant or the fly. I don't know, because they got some of everything. They have things for your house, for the inside and the outside. And I do have a discount code, and it will be listed either in the comment section of this video or in the description of this video, along with every item that I show you today that is going to be presented in this video. Now, here's the disclaimer. As I was picking these swimsuits, I saw a dress that I wanted to show you guys. So we have seven items, and one is a dress, okay? It is a flowy, colorful, summery dress, but everything else is swimsuits. And are you ready? Are you ready to sit by the pool? Where are you going, girl, on your next vacation? Talk to Cece, let me know. Well, if you are ready and you trying to get ready, well, today, baby, I got you. We're gonna do these swimsuits and we're gonna slay each and every last one of them. And remember, with every purchase that you purchase on Shein, using my discount code, you get 15% off when you check out, okay? You can't beat that. You cannot be getting 15% off. Girl, everybody is trying to save a coin these days. I don't know about you, but I know I am. So we're going to go on. We're going to rock into these swimsuits. I want you to give this video a thumbs up right now. Give it a thumbs up because you're going to like it. Now, another disclaimer is that I have not tried on anything. So I don't know how they're going to fit. I don't know if they're going to fit or if they're not going to fit. But we're going to find out together, okay? All right? So stick around. Don't go nowhere. I will not be before you too long, okay? You all know I'm a talker. But I'm going to try to get this done quickly so you can go on about your day, wherever you may be, all right? All right. So stick around. We're going to rock into this very, very first swimsuit, and we just going to glide and flow through here. All right, y'all. Here we go. All right, you guys, so here is the very first swimsuit. Now, if you've been watching CeCe's Fashion is My Passion YouTube channel, you all know that I like anything that has some fringes, okay? I love anything that has some fringes. I love this swimsuit. Not too particularly fond of the swimsuit uh, bottoms, okay? Because they are a little cheeky, okay? I'm turning all the way around. They're a little cheeky, girl. They're a little cheeky. Yes, ma'am. They're a little cheek, cheek, cheeky. Okay? They're not high-waisted. And I would have preferred if they had been high-waisted. So you see, they don't come all the way up covering the belly. So you see the belly button. So that's the only thing I don't like about this particular swimsuit. This, this, this is a two-piece swimsuit. Like I said, it has the fringes. And it does crisscross in the back. I do have on my bra with this. I just want you all to know, okay? I don't have any underwear on, but I have my bra on because these pads, girl, they doing their own thing. They supposed to be way, way down here. Will you see them? So I don't know what they doing, but I can't get them to flip out. So because I couldn't get them to flip out, because I couldn't get them to flip out. I just said, let me put my bra on, okay? Now, I'm a person that wear my bra, and I will wear underwear under here too, to the pool, okay? Because I'm 
just a little self-conscious. You know, I don't, you know, my breasts are already, I'm 54 years old, if you did not know. This is your first time here, let me tell you, I'm 54, okay? I am 5'4", 54. So my breasts ain't up here no more. They down here, okay? So I need a lift, even with a swimsuit, because swimsuits sometimes do not give you the coverage that you need, okay? It just don't, baby. And you don't wanna be out there, you know, at the beach or the pool, now, like this, you see how you see my bra I got on a brown bra. You see how that's hanging up under there? Now imagine if I ain't had this bra on. The tip would be all the way down here. And then you bending down, and then you hit somebody kid in the head or the owl. You walk, you know, you knock over their sand castle or whatever they doing on the beach, cause your tit and fell out. And now you would scared everybody at the pool. I'm not trying to do that, okay? I'm not trying to do um the Rasputia thing, you know, at the at the water park. I'm not trying to do that. So I put my bra on, child. Now you do what you want to do, but if you ain't got no hanging boo-boos, then you go right here. But I do, okay? Mass is down south. They've been down there a long time, and baby, they is not coming back home. And it is what it is, because I'm how old? 54. So it does have a little elastic right here, okay? Right here. Just a little bit. But girl, you see what I'm saying? Look at that. Look at that. I just want I just want you to look at it, okay? So if you busty, if you bustier, if you busty like me, or if you are bustier, put your bra on. Don't go on that beach or that pool and, and, and scare them babies. Do not. You will scar somebody for life. But she cute though. She real cute. Look at the pattern on the uh swim shorts. Look at that. And it is in one of my favorite colors, which is blue. So baby, she's styling and profiling. Yes, she is, baby. Yes, she is. Oh, I like her. I like her. I like her. And I like the fact that it has the fringes. So the fringes do kind of camouflage the booty meat. You know what I'm saying? It do. So, it does camouflage. So thank God that they gave us some fringes, right? Because without the fringes, it's really doing what it's what what it's doing. Now I'm gonna tell you this right now. If it was me and I was wearing this out on the beach, I would probably have on an additional cover up, okay? Or I would wear this top with some other bottoms that are more high waisted and more covering of the booty. All right. So this is the first one, and I love her, love her, love her. Sorry, y'all. Can't believe that one on the cats. I did that. All right, you all. We're going to go on to swimsuit number two. All right, you guys. Here's swimsuit number two. I love this swimsuit. I love the colors. You have lime green and orange. And then it's trimmed in a little blue right in here and around the booty. Okay, so this is how it looks in the back. It does have a functioning uh, clasp, clasp here that you can, you know, uh, you can take it and put the clasp in. I did not do it that way. What I did was I just stepped right into it and pulled it right on up. Again, I have my bra on with this, okay? But isn't she pretty? She's cute. I love it. I love her. She's a little cheeky too. Okay, just a little cheeky. Just a little. I just put some Vaseline on. But she's a little cheeky as well, but not too cheeky, okay? Now one thing I wanna tell you ladies or gentlemen, if you buy swimsuits for your lady, inside of the crotch area, she in always puts a little plastic, looks like a, a panty liner. And that is just to let you know that nobody else has tried them on. They all come with this little plastic thing that says she in and it's right in the crotch area. And I like that they do that because that's letting you know that they're coming right out of the warehouse and nobody is trying on your stuff. Cause you know, I've seen women go in the dressing rooms to try on swimsuits and they try them on with a bare coochie. And they don't put no, no 
underwear on. You're not supposed to try swimsuits on in a retail store with no underwear on because what if the swimsuit does not fit? Let me put this down here. Let me keep knocking this down. What if the swimsuit don't fit? Now you would have your cooch in that area and another woman coming to try it on. You know what I'm saying? That's just nasty and it ain't, it's trifling and it ain't clean. So when you receive your swimsuits at home, you're gonna have that little plastic sticker and I'll bring it out uh, when I show you all the next swimsuits. You'll see what I'm talking about. That's gonna be in there. Now, here's the thing, ladies. Make sure you take it out, okay? Make sure you take it out. It is not meant to stay in the crotch area because you will be walking on the beach and that thing will be slapped to your leg and people will be like, what is that on her thigh, on her inner thigh? So make sure you take it out, okay? And I suggest that you even wash these swimsuits before you wear them. Now that's just me, okay? But everybody don't do that. But it's all about your comfortability, okay? But sometimes, you know, it's okay to wash them. But they do come with a little plastic thing. But let's go back and talk about this swimsuit for a minute, shall we? Is she or she not cute? Now, the thing I like about this swimsuit is that it ain't cutting. You know what I'm talking about. When it be cutting, girl. When it be cutting and it be tight. And then, then when you get ready to take it off, you got a real, you got a, a, a rash or some type of irritation. And it's all red. This is not like that. Okay? It's very comfortable. And this is why, ladies, you have to know what size you wear. Okay? I wear a size between a size 4X and a 5X. Okay? So you gotta know. But if you're looking at this video and you're going, I'm shaped up like CC. Well, guess what? If you are, you'll be able to get into this. Okay? What I also like about it is that um, it's kind of cam camouflage in the fupa area with this lighter color right here. But again, you can always put on a uh, shawl, uh, uh, I'm not a shawl, a, a cover up with this, okay? Whatever your comfortability is, I myself would put on a cover up with it, okay? That's just me. But if you do what is best for you. But I think that she is cute. I love her. And I love the way this, like I said, is trimmed in blue. And yes, this is a real 54-year-old body. I ain't had no surgery, no nothing, even though I want to have some surgery, okay? So when you looking at me before you get on here talking about, ooh, you got cellulite. Yes, bitch, I do. Before you come on here talking about, ooh, you got wrinkles, you got dimples. Yes, bitch, I do, okay? I do. I do, because I'm how old? 54. Not 34 or 24. I'm a 54 year old woman. So this body and been through some things, okay? We ain't had a child. We ain't gained weight, we ain't lost weight. We ain't gained, we ain't lost. We ain't gained, we ain't lost, okay? And I'm what? 54. I'm 54. And I think I look damn good for 54, but it is what it is. You understand what I'm saying? It's what it is, okay? But that's all right, because God is still good in the midst of it all. He good, because, you know, I can look a lot of different ways. But don't get on here talking about my goddamn cellulite. Please don't, because you're going to get cussed out. Please don't get on here talking about these wrinkles and these dimples, because you're going to get cussed out. Because if you got a mama, your mama got the same thing. <laughs> <clears throat> Did I stutter? No, I didn't. I'm just saying. So y'all love to get on people videos and talk about at all the imperfections that people have. Listen here. If you living, keep living. If you young and you get to be older or old, you won't have it. That's why I'm getting tired of these folks talking about President Biden and how old he is. That man can't help that he's 81 years old. He is what the it is. Leave him alone. Get your ass out there and vote. And I thought I would uh, interject that into this video. Get out and vote. Who would you rather have? I'm not, that, that's all I'm gonna say. I ain't finna get into politics, but I am finna get into this age thing that people always try to talk about people that's getting older. If you keep living, like my daddy used to tell me, 
keep living. I used to laugh at stuff that would happen to my daddy when he would have his glasses on top of his head and he couldn't find them or he couldn't find his phone and it was on the chart. He said, keep living. And everything that my daddy told me, guess what? It's happening to me. I forget. As soon as I walk in the room, I said, what did I walk in here for? I can't remember what happened five minutes ago. Keep living. So don't you get your ass on here talking about my cellulite. Hmm. Don't you get your ass on here talking about you got dimples and ripples and cellulite. Do not, because your mama, your auntie, your great-grandmama, and your grandmama, and your woman who you laying next to got the same shit. <laughs> Okay, let's resume. <clears throat> Do you like her? Because I like her. She is beautiful. She giving, baby. Ain't she giving? She cute. Yes, she is. All right. So we're going to go on to somebody was sitting here on this couch and ate some cake because I see cake frosting. Mm, okay. Anyway, I think it was the guest that was sitting here from last week from the house one party. Why people don't clean up behind themselves? All right, that's a whole other story. Okay, we're going to go on to swimsuit number three. All right, so here is swimsuit number three. Now, I picked this one because I felt like, okay, it's not real, real, <coughs> excuse me, not real, real sexy. Who's oh, excuse me. <coughs> Sorry, like something got caught in my throat. I picked this one because I thought, I, didn't, I, I was kind of like trying to find something that wasn't too, too sexy, right? But girl, after I put this on, I said, girl, this is sexy, okay? This is sexier than I thought. Now, the model on Shein didn't have all of this boom, 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 okay? The boom, boom that I got. So that's why I picked it because I thought that it wouldn't look so boom, boom, but it's still boom, boom. <laughs> it's still boom, boom. And you know what I'm saying? It's still doing it because if you got a lot of boom, boom, it's gonna boom boom. You know what I'm saying? It, I mean, it's gonna do what it's gonna do, okay? Cause I got a lot of this, a lot of thighs, a lot of everything, you know what I'm saying? But I thought this was really cute. It does have stretch, not a whole lot of stretch, but again, I would put on a cover up with this, okay? I would put on a cover up. Now, what I did really like about this swimsuit was that it did zip. It zips all the way down, okay? Like so zips and it was real easy to zip i did like the back the way that the back comes into a t so it looks like you have on a white beater i like that okay so it's still you know got the booty cheeks on fleek as they say but it's comfortable though it's very comfortable so I like it. I really, really like it. And then right here, it has this little, um, this little sign right here. You know what I'm saying? So I like that. And it does have uh, padding in the breast. I like that as well. It's given, right? It's given. So you can put on some swim pants with this or a cover up. I do like the material. The material is that um, that material where when, if you sweat in this, if you like sitting by the pool and you sweating or in the water or whatever, it's that material where it absorbs your sweat. I can't think of the name of it, but you all know what I'm talking about. So it is very absorbing, okay? I like the fact that it does camouflage the belly area, the fupa. It's a little cheeky, okay? But again, if you're working with a lot, this is what you're gonna get, okay? So just know that. Now, if you ain't working with all of this, then you're gonna be fine. But if you are, then this is what it is, okay? So this is, you know, this is as far, this is as much coverage as you're gonna get because, because I have such you know, a big butt and big thighs, my clothes just, you know, it eat my body type, my body, my shape, my voluptuous, it eats up the clothes, okay? So, everything on me just be, it just sucks it right on up.
but I thought she was really, really cute. I really, really like this swimsuit. I really, really like her. And it's very, very comfortable. Very comfortable. And the thing that I really liked about it was that although it's, although it's uh, eating up the material, the body, if the back of this is still not going all the way up in the building and getting lost, okay? Nobody got to send a, we don't have to send a search party out to find out where the rest of the swimsuit is, okay? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So I like that. So please tell me what you all think of this one, okay? Now, gentlemen, I know y'all gonna have something to say. Y'all always be like, yummy, will you look good, blah, 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 blah. But I wanna hear from the women on here about this particular swimsuit, what you all think, what you all rock this, because we already know what the fellas gonna say. Because the fellas like booty, okay? They like thickness, they like the thighs, they like the hips, they like, you know, they like it all, right? So we already know what the fellas gonna say. They gonna say, it look good to me. You know what I'm saying? Then you get some knuckleheads on here that will always want to kind of come for me too, you know, and have something to say. You know, them be the ones to say, oh, you look like you busting out like a can of biscuits. Your mama. That's it. That's all. That's all I got to say. But for the most part, the fellas are real supportive of what I do over here on this platform. And you are always support and comment and like. And you are always uh, watch my videos. So I do appreciate you all. But I do have some women over here too who support CC's fashion is my passion. So for the ladies, I wanna know what you all think about this and what you rock this swimsuit, okay? I'm just saying, let me know. I need your feedback. I need to know what you're thinking. What's your thoughts? How would you do this? Would you do it, okay? Cause I know it's a lot of ladies on here that be like, CC, I'm not putting on no swimsuit. I don't care what you show, I'm not doing it, okay? And I understand, I understand, I understand. But sometimes, you can do other things to camouflage your swimsuit. You understand what I'm saying? You can camouflage, because here's the thing, ladies. Let me say this to you all, then I'm, we gonna go on to the next thing. You have what you have. Amen, somebody. Let me come a little closer. You have what you have, and you cannot mask that or squish it down or roll it up and put it somewhere else. It is what it is, baby, okay? God blessed a lot of us with a lot of things. And if he blessed you with all of this, it is what it is, all right? So you can't try to act like it ain't there. It's there. But what you can do is that you can wear things that are, are complementary to your shape and still feel comfortable in your skin. Because what we want to do over here, what I'm teaching women is to be comfortable in your skin. I don't care if you a size 8 or you a size 28. I want you to love you and I want you to be comfortable in your skin. I want you to look up every look up every day. First, when you get up out that bed and give God some praise, say, thank you, God, that you woke me up this morning. Then I want you to go and I want you to stand in that mirror and I want you to say, good morning, gorgeous, as Mary J. Blige would say. With no makeup, with no nothing. I love me just the way I am because I'm beautiful, I'm amazing, and I'm all that and a bag of chips. And I might be a big bag, but that's all right. Amen, somebody. Come on, come on, come on. Say amen, amen. So that's what my goal and my mission on this channel is to do, is to make every plus-size woman, every small-size woman, every medium-size woman, every nationality of woman to feel good about her. The young, the middle-aged, and the older. The seasoned woman. We got to feel good about ourselves. Don't be listening to all this crap that we see about us getting older. It is what it is, and we cannot change what we are and who we are. And on that note, we gonna go on to the next swimsuit. All right, so here's swimsuit number four. What you all think about this one? I like her too. This is, to me, it's perfect for the island, right? Now, I know right now over in Jamaica, they having that, um, is it Berlin, I think? The, the hurricane over there. So praying for the people over in Jamaica that they will be able to restore their town and praying that no one was seriously hurt. I haven't heard that, so praying for them. But this just speaks island, honey. Island, island, island. Now, for those of you all that don't know, girlfriend is going to Putacana. I will be gone July 25th 
through the 29th. So Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and I fly out and come back on a Monday. So what y'all think? Y'all think I should wear this one to Punta Cana? There's the back, okay? I do like that it has these little ties right here. So you can make these um, ties on the, they're functioning ties. You can make this tight. Now I didn't pull these because it fit my body perfectly. I do have on my bra, cause y'all see, this is where the, where the tits would be if I didn't have on a bra. All right? So I got I have on a bra because I need I, I need to feel comfortable. Okay, everybody needs to feel comfortable in their own skin. It does have the pads, okay, but the pads do not support these big jugs on my on my in front of my chest. They just do not. It does have it crisscrosses and it has this little tie right here. Now I didn't untie none of this. I left it just the way that it was because I didn't want to mess up nothing. Okay, so I just left it. I just left it as is. But I like her. I like this open uh, slit right here. So you see in a little belly, just a little, right? Just a little, not too much. So I do like that. I like her. I like her. <laughs> I like these colors. I really like the colors because to me, the colors just speak island girl it just speaks like yeah let's go lay out on the beach baby put that suntan lotion on Chris cross your legs lay back in that chair and say hey let that sun hit where it hit you know what I'm saying it's just that kind of a swimsuit to me again cover up swim pants whatever way you want to do it and I do believe I have one item in here that has the swim pants with it, which is good because that way you can get an idea of how your swimsuit can look with some swim pants on, okay? So let me know what y'all think about her. She doing the doggone thing right here, baby. Yes, ma'am, she is. So now you've come this far down the road in this video. Are you or are you not convinced that she ain't got some bomb ass swimsuits? <laughs> are you not convinced? Because you should be by now. If you still sitting on the fence going, mm, I don't know. Come on, huh? Come on now. Come on. You seen it. You see it. These swimsuits ladies do have stretch. Okay? They do. Look at that. They have stretch. So they're not binding. They're not constricting. It's not like you can't move with them. You can move with them, okay? You can move, you can move, you can move. They do have stretch. But again, if you are big chested, heavier chested, you gonna need on your bra because your titties is gonna come down here. And again, they gonna be swinging. And you don't wanna embarrass yourself, nor do you wanna hurt somebody. I'm just keeping it 100. I just put my bra on and I got on a strapless bra with this. Cause I wanna have a little cleavage. I want my breasts to look cute in my swimsuit. So I always put my bra on because I don't get in the water anyway. I don't know how to swim and I don't swim. And before you talk about it, because I don't know how to swim, I've never learned and I need to. And my son needs to learn. He, he started taking swim classes when he was little. We never, he never completed the course. But we all need to learn how to swim. I don't like water like that. I really don't. I fear water. I fear water. But love to be on somebody's beach and hide. Now go fit. But I don't like walk like that. She cute. She is cute. The colors are giving. Yes, ma'am and yes, sir. I like her. Yes. All right, y'all. We're gonna go on to what is this? Swimsuit. Swimsuit number five. Swimsuit number five. All right, so here's swimsuit number five. Now, is she cute or is she cute? She cute, but well, let me tell you something. This shit was confusing as hell to get on. Let me tell you why. This top, okay, so let me show you. This top has this, right? So, it has this top that's built into this. So, when I tried to put this on, I didn't realize that I had to put this on Put it over my head and this was built into it 
So girl, it was all twisted this way and that way. It was going somewhere everywhere. But I finally figured it out and got it on. Definitely a hitter. It's cute. Now, we gonna talk about these shorts right here, baby. Then here, then here. If your thighs is like mine and they thick in between, right here, you see what they doing, right? You see, I don't have no underwear on with these. I just got on my, <laughs> my bare skin It's under here. Baby, they cut. They are cutting. They are tight. They are calling on Jesus and all the ancestors because they tight. And this is how they look in the back. So you see the dip right here. You won't see all the crack of the building, but you're going to see some crack of the building. So what I would probably do with these, now I know you're going to say, Sherelle, Cece, that's crazy. My real name is Sherelle, for those of you to hear, for the very first time. Everybody calls me Cece. My government name is Sherelle, and it ain't spelled with no S. It's C-H-E-R-A-L. Okay, that's my name. But for years, people have been calling me Cece because I have a Set a first name with a C and a last name with a C if you want to know how the name came apart, uh, came, became CC is because of my first initial and my last initial and my last name. Now, before you say CC or Sherelle, whichever name you know me by, some of y'all been knowing me all my life, this on here, you know me only by Sherelle. You might be sitting there going, now, why the hell would you put a thong on with that? Well, let me tell you why. Because when you get ready to sit down and you get ready to stand up, I guarantee you that somehow, somewhere, somebody gonna see the crack. And they might see a whole lot of crack. And I ain't talking about the crack you smoke. I'm talking about that crack that's back here. And you might scare somebody. And somebody might wanna fight you before it's all over because her husband was looking at your crack. So I would suggest putting on some underwear under these or putting on a thong. Because baby, when you sit down and you stand up, you gonna see something. And here's why I tell you that. Cause this top will not stay down. So you gonna either have to hold your top when you stand up, or you gonna have to have on some underwear or a thong with this. But she is cute. She is rocking and she is cute. I love these colors. And I love the way this matches. And you know what, this don't remind me of no swimsuit. This is really kind of like, a short set that you will wear if you on vacation on the beach, okay? But I'm telling you this right now. This right here, this right here, all of this, you gonna need to put some baby oil, some Vaseline, some baby powder right here. Cause it's gonna rise up. You might be giving camel toe before it's all over. Make sure you keep your legs crossed and closed, okay? You're going to be giving something because this is going to rise up. Because if your thighs are big like man, they don't give you, they don't give you no mercy. Okay, they don't give you no mercy. They don't be saying, oh, you know, well, we going to, uh-uh. The thighs don't give no mercy. Okay, they don't give you no grace or no mercy. So just know that, that when you, you like this, and it's real cute, girl, it's real, real cute. But see how, see how the top, see, okay, let me show you. See that? Okay, but it slides up. See how, see how it ride up? It ride up, right? So you got that in the back. See how it just went up? Cause you got a lot of booty that's gonna push it up. So you got that, and then you got this in the front with the camel toe and, and, and the rash and, 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 and the redness when it's all said and done. Just keeping it 100, okay? So you gonna have to put, I would suggest putting some underwear on with this to smooth it on out, okay? Either a thong or some underwear. And I know you wanna wear it like this, cause girlfriend, I do too. But the fact that the matter is, we gotta deal with what we gotta deal with now, come on. We just got to. So it's gonna rise up, but the color is beautiful. I like the way that they did this, that they put this, you know, inside of a tank top, it's a little confusing to get it on. Once you get it on, you're gonna be okay. But it's giving summer vibes. It's giving the summer vibes. It's giving beach vibes. It's giving, hey, I wanna go hang out 
I want to lay out. You know what I'm saying? And the stripes are really, really cute. All the little color stripes. You know, and it's giving big girl friendly because of the stripes. So it don't look bad. It really, really don't. It's just that you got those things that you got to get through, which is the crack and the that. This and this, this and this, okay? And that. You get past that, you're going to be all right. This did not, I would have preferred if this had came in a size 5X, which is a size 22. I need a size 22. Yeah, dog, and I need a size 24. Baby, I think I need a size 26 in this. I'm just saying. Because my booty and my thighs and my hips is eating these shorts up. They're eating them up. They're eating them up. So I would have preferred that they she in. Baby, can you give us this in another size? Can y'all go up two more sizes on this? Because we want this. We want it. I get this in another color. In another color. Because this is how much I like this. But baby, you need to give us a bigger size in this. Come on now. Y'all the plus size curve people. Then we need the plus and we need the curve. Come on. Y'all go up. Go up some. Go up some. You dealing with the people over here in America. The, 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 the woman that's got the real shape. We ain't little, okay? I'm just saying. But we like it. I like it. It's cute. But we need you to go up a size. Help us out. Come on, help us out. Let's have a prayer meeting about this. I'm just saying. Can we touch and agree that we need a bigger size, ladies? Can we touch and agree? Let's touch and agree. All right? All right, so we're going to go on to the next swimsuit, girl. All right, y'all, this is the last swimsuit. Now, this is what I'm talking about, about swimsuit cover-up pants, okay? Now I saved this one for the for the last swimsuit to show you. The last item I have to show you is a dress. This is our last swimsuit, okay, in this haul. But I wanted to make this one the last one because I wanted to show you all what I was talking about, about putting on swimsuit cover up pants. You can buy swimsuit cover up pants uh, 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 as a standalone item without having them as a three piece. This just happens to be a three piece bathing suit. She is cute. This is one of my favorite colors, which is blue. Now, they did right by this one, and I'm going to tell you why. Because when you take these pants off, I'm just going to slide them just right here. Because let me tell you something about these, uh, about these pants. When I was pulling them up, the seams were screaming, mercy me. They was cricking and crackling and popping and doing a whole lot of other stuff. So this is what I'm talking about. You see this? Look at that. Is this the one back in this? No. Okay, so look. Look how that's eating. You see what I'm saying? I mean, it's eating, okay? You need some shorts on with this because this is getting ready to turn into a freaking thong. My booty is about to, it's about to my cheeks is, when you get to walking, this is gonna slide, 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 and it's gonna be up in there. And you gonna need a search party to get that sucker out. But if you got on these pants with it, you can't really see that. You see what I'm saying? Cause it's giving you the coverage. It is not a lot of stretch in these. Baby, we needed a size 5X in this one too. We needed 22 in this one too. But they did right by doing what? They knew, they, got, they, they understood the assignment with this one. They said, hey, we need to give these girls some pants because they're about to be a thong. And the pants do have stretch. They don't have a lot of stretch, okay? But they got enough. They got enough. And then right here, look at this. You got the ruffles down the side. So even though it's cheeky and you can see through here the cheek part, okay? But it ain't like it's open, wide open, and it's just standing out there like boom, bam. Right? Come on, come on. Y'all understand what I'm saying? So this is perfect, perfect. Now, this right here, you can't wear no bra with this because it just ain't gonna look right. It's just gonna take away from what is supposed to be a bikini top. Now I'm gonna tell you, I'm going to Pusacana and we going on a boat cruise where we gonna be on a cat catamaran, I think that's the name of it. This is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this. Okay, and I have several 
swimsuits like this. Some that I got off of another place. I can't say the name because I am doing, this is a Shein. I'm doing a collaboration. I should have said that at the beginning, but this is a collaboration with Shein, okay? They sent these items to me. But y'all know the other place that I used to shop from all the time, okay? That is no longer uh, in, in uh, the, they folded. The company is no longer. But this is what this is, okay? So this is the back. Now, let me tell you what else she ain't got right, or whoever d designed this one. They made sure they gave you a thick strap here at the neck, okay? A thick strap. They also gave you, they also gave you a strap around here where you can pull this so you are not having no boobage spillage over here and you ain't having no spillage under here, okay? You ain't having no spillage. Now, it is what it is with this. I don't, my, my girls, they, you know, again, they don't sit up high and they don't come all the way together. So you ain't gonna get a whole lot of cleavage with this, okay? You ain't gonna get a whole lot. But you can adjust this. You can make this as tight as you want it or as loose as you want it, depending on how you want to wear it. But she pretty. Is she not pretty? I love this color. I love this color. And I, what I also like is they gave you this thick band. So you ain't got to worry about when you sit down, this slide on down. You know what I'm saying? This band is going to keep these pants in place. This is perfect if you're going to be out on the boat. Because it's covering up your legs. So you're not really getting that sun, a lot of sunburn. You can always, always put on another little top with this if you wanted to cover up your back, okay, so you wouldn't get burned. But she is cute. She is cute. She cute. Yes, honey, she is cute. Just know this. If you are hippie and you get this and you pull this up, these things, they're not buff. Thank you, Jesus. Not buff. Because this is mesh, so it does stretch. Just know this. It's going to be cracking, and it's going to be popping. It's going to have its own little rap song. Own little rap song when you're pulling it up, okay? It's going to be pop, popping, and popping. But it's going to be all right. You can get it up. You can get, you can get it on. Now, let me say you can get it up. You can get it on, okay? You can get it on. So they did us right, lady, when it, ladies, when it came to this one. They did us right. They understood the assignment when it came to this one. Yes, ma'am, they did. Yes. I love this. So you do get three pieces. You get the bikini top, and then you get the bikini swim shorts and the cover-up pants. And I like it that it comes up so it camouflages the belly. You understand what I'm saying? And so if this creep up and it go into the building and it's a thong by the end of, you know, your little excursion, that's all right because you got these pants on. Just let it go on and creep up. Just rock with it with the pants. Just rock with it, rock with it, roll with it. You understand what I'm saying? Just roll with it. You'll be all right. You're going to be all right. All right, y'all. So this is our last swimsuit. And now I'm going to show you a dress. Don't ask me how I got this dress in this haul. But I did. But we're going to show it to you right now. All right, you guys. This is the last item in this haul. The very last. And it is a dress. I love her. Girlfriend. Yes, I do. I love these colors, honey. This, this dress is coloring. When I tell you that the colors this year... In sundresses and body kind dresses has been on point, on point. Look at that. Look at this. It's loud, ain't it? It's loud. It's really loud. <laughs> it is loud. 
It is saying, I am here. It is saying that no matter what color you have on, girl, I got you. I got you. It's long, it's tall, girl friendly. I am 5'7". If you are taller than me, you're gonna really like this dress. If you 5'11", 5'10", 5'11", 6'1", so forth and so on, you're gonna like this, because you see where it's hitting. It's hitting all the way down to my feet. All the way. And if you know me, you know I like these type of dresses. Why? Because they are slimming, they make you look slim, they camouflage your figure, they hide all the things you want to hide. Not that we try to hide nothing, but if we want to camouflage something, or we, if you want to hide it, this is the type of dress. Now, a lot of women think that, you know, they think that if they wear a short dress with what we have, that, that, don't, that the shorter dress don't make them look bigger. It actually does. It, it really does. And the reason for the reason why I say that is because it's showing off all the dimples and ripples. Now I just told you all to embrace what you have, right? But I also did say go out here and look crazy in what you do have. Okay? That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is that we can do anything and everything in moderation and still look really, really good to be a plus size one. Me, myself, this is my style of dressing. It's very rare that you'll see me in a dress up to my knee, above my knee. It's either going to be to the knee, below the knee, or it's going to be down here hitting the floor, okay? I feel more comfortable in this. I just feel comfortable. I feel chilled. I feel relaxed. I just feel like I can go anywhere in, a, in this type of a dress and just look beautiful. I mean, you can wear any color accessory with this. You can wear orange, you have pink, yellow, uh, turquoise blue, you have green. I mean, just look at this. And what I like about this dress, look at this dress. Look at how the, it's, it's, it's sectioned off the different colors and the waves. So it, it camouflages those areas again that we want to camouflage. Now let's talk about this peekaboo right here. So you got a little peekaboo, right? Right here. Not too low cut, so you definitely could wear this to church. You could wear it to work. You could put on a jacket with this if you didn't want to show, you know, your arms. If you're a little self-conscious about that or you don't think it's appropriate. It's very age appropriate. And then you have this right here. Where you can pull it. So this untied. It was already tied up, and I just left it tied. But you can untie this, and you can make it tighter. See that? Do it, do it, come on. Oh, maybe it's, it don't do that. Okay, so this is just, I thought that it did. Do it. I know y'all like, girl, get it together. No, I, it, I'm pulling it, but it's not pulling. So, it is showing my bra a little bit, so I need to pull it up on the side, like that, like so. So I thought these two strings pull, but they don't. Okay, they don't. So, I don't know why they don't, but here is where you could let it out a little bit. And you still, it still looks really, really cute. It's still not really low cut. Where it, you know, so if you bend it, if you bend over, you ain't gotta worry about your, your breast falling out because it's just a little dip, which is just enough. But see, I'm smaller. My waistline, this part of me is small. When you get down here, you get down here, it's a whole nother person, okay? But for me, I always have to pull my dress up because it's always gay here on the side because I'm small right in here. Girl, I used to have a badass shape when I was young. I mean, badass shape. She's still in there, but she just brought some of her girlfriends with her, and I had gained a lot of weight. But I like this 
dress. I do. I really like this dress. And like I said, um, I'm really disappointed that this don't tie. I mean, that this don't pull so you can make it tighter on the side. But other than that, she's gorgeous. She is gorgeous. I'm just going to tie this. this all up. I would have preferred that this did not tie. That you just put this over your head. I would prefer if it had just been uh, like, I don't, cause I don't know how I tied that. Yeah, I don't know how I tied it. I just would prefer that it had, been, had just been a sleeveless dress. I mean, what I mean by that is that you just put it on and it just had the sleeves without you having to tie this. This wasn't necessary. Why was this necessary? Because it don't pull. So why was this necessary? This just was not necessary, in my opinion. It just was not. Because it don't do nothing. It ain't pulling. So why y'all put it on here? Okay, girlfriend, whatever. So this is the dress. Without, except for this, this stupid tie, I like the dress. I like it. Love it, love it, love it. I'm going to do something with this tie. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I'm going to do something. Because who in the hell got time to tie this up if you home by yourself and you can't tie this? <laughs> if, it, if it don't pull, if it ain't functioning, what you got it on here for? I don't even understand. But anyway, that's how I feel about that. Otherwise, the dress is gorgeous. It's beautiful. You wear any kind of accessory, shoe, jacket, shawl. It's pretty. And like I said, I love the way it's the way and how it's camouflaging the body. She's beautiful. And if you got a big booty, it's gonna lay anywhere. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna lay on your booty. It don't matter. It's gonna lay because, and you got a stomach, that's just what it's gonna do because it's made out of that uh, polyester kind of cotton material. So it does cling a little bit, but she is cute. Well, you all, we have come to the end. I want to show you all this. We have come to the end of this video. I certainly hope you enjoyed what I showed you today because I certainly enjoyed every last piece. Was it too much I didn't like? I liked everything except this is annoying. Um, Shein, you all need to go up in your sizes on your swimsuits and you need to give plus size women high waisted briefs in swimwear. That's my one thing that I would suggest, okay? And most of your swimsuits need to be a 5X, which is a size 22, especially when, we, when you're dealing with curvy, curvy, boom, 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 vivacious women. But I wanna thank my representative over at She and Jessie. Thank you so much, you are a darling. You always send me whatever I request, so thank you so much. I am hoping that she will um, except my recent request, which is to do a lingerie body stock and haul. You all been asking for that. So I hope that she will approve that, but I'll let you know, I'll keep you posted. But what I wanna show you before we end this video, this is what's in the crotch of each swimsuit, okay? See, it says she in, okay? So this is what's inside of your swimsuit. So, again, when you get your swimsuits home, this is going to be in the inside. going to say she in. It's going to be stuck inside of the crotch area. Make sure you take this out because you will be walking down the beach and it will be stuck to your thigh and people are going to be talking about you. So make sure you take them out and make sure you throw them away, okay? But this lets you know that ain't nobody been in your swimsuit. That it came di directly from the manufacturer, you know what I'm saying? And nobody been trying on your swimsuit because again, that's just nasty and that's just trifling. I'm just saying, if you try on swimsuits in a retail store, please keep your underwear on or whatever your space or whatever until you get it home and then you can do what you want to do with it, all right? Well, I enjoyed doing this video for you all. I know it's gonna be a little long, but y'all know I'm long-winded. Y'all already know, but I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed filming it for you. Thank you for stopping on by once again for my real ones that's here each and every time I upload a video. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're new here and it's your first time looking at a video, I hope you will not 
make this your last time because we like to have fun over here. We like to kick it and chill and get it in. And I hope you'll come back and I hope that you'll hit that subscribe button so you can help your girl. Yeah, I'm your girl now. If you watch this whole video, we friends, we friends. I hope you hit the subscribe button so that I can get to 17,000 because I'm at 16,625 YouTube subscribers and your girl is trying to get to 17,000 by September 1st. So go on and hit that YouTube, that YouTube subscribe button and come on, turn on your bell notification so you will not miss each a video that I upload. I upload seven days a week, girl. And if that's too much for you, I understand. But if you like me, you gonna come on and watch me at some point. So hit that subscribe button, give this video, I hope you already have, give this video a thumbs up and leave me a nice comment in the comment section like Miss Brazil say. Leave me a nice comment. If you don't watch Miss Brazil, go over there and watch her. Miss Brazil always say, leave her a nice comment. So I stole that from her. Leave me a nice comment in the comment section and let me know what you thought about today's fit video. God bless each and every last one of you. And girl, you already know where you gonna see me in the next CC's Fashion Is My Passion YouTube video. God bless you. I love you from the bottom of my heart. Bye, y'all. See you real soon.